This is uh, this is the new area that I'm showing you. I've shown you before. This is um, Venice Beach Main Street. You know, up from Marine. You know, that's Marine. So if you travel north from Marine, this is T-Mobile there. You see, there's all new stores here. New restaurants, new bars, Japanese, um, all kinds of like new stores here, new developments. You know, I might have visited here in uh, 2013 and then uh, 2017 is when I used to live in Huntington Beach and taking the 710 Express bus to City National Bank at 555 South Flower Street and I did visit Santa Monica Beach and Venice Beach. But it wasn't like this in 2017 or 2013, you know, so I've been living in L.A. now since 2019 because then I went to Vegas for, I went to like, through San Bernardino and to Vegas for a while to try to make it as a singer, but I couldn't get a job. This is like O'Brien's, I wonder if this is like Abigail O'Brien or like Aaron, or like Aaron Kunkel from uh, Everest, First Presbyterian Church of Oakland, <coughs> I'm not sure. And, uh, you know, that's like Waco, Texas, and uh, David Koresh, and the Branch Davidians, and Jonestown, Guyana, and uh, Everest, and Oakland, and Gavin Newsom, and Joe Biden, Hunter uh, Biden, and, you know, they're all part of that Illuminati. What is it called? Illuminati, the occult. But there's a difference between the Illuminati, which is like an occult, and, and like a militant occult, like Waco, Texas, and David Koresh, and... Um, the branch of the videos. You know, if you have it under control, you know, you're the occult, like the movie Angel Heart. But if you have it under control, you know, but this new uh, occult is like the militant occult. It's not just an occult, it's militant. And they will not give you a penny. You know, they would rather die than give you a penny because they just live another day, you know. They don't really care. So, uh, Oh, here's Tyler. So, um, this is a, a very nice area here. All new development. This was definitely not like this in 2017 or before that. It wasn't even like this in 2019. This is like all new stuff in like the last four or five years. It's all new. And it's looking pretty good here during the day. It's looking like a party, you know. Party people. You've that you a football game. Football. Little college. This is uh, this is like a new spring break. This is like all year round spring break, you know. I mean, check it out, man. It's like three weeks before Halloween, October 28th, and it's still spring break here, man. Look at this. People have increased on tourism, and people relocating to Los Angeles and Santa Monica. And Venice Beach, people have increased tenfold or a hundredfold because this is like the new spring break all year round, man. You can't beat this weather. And a really nice place to party. Beautiful people, beautiful girls, beautiful people everywhere. Got some, you got everything here. I really love what they've done to this section of town, you know. This is uh, north of Marine on Main Street. They got the music going on. They got the bands. They got the sunshine. They got the beautiful people. They got the party. I'm telling you, man, it's like spring break all year round. It's like, why wait till January and go to Florida? Why go to Fort Lauderdale for spring break? You got the spring break right now going on. And... If you're familiar with like the equator, if you're familiar like the equator, Los Angeles, Santa Monica, Venice, like right on the equator. So um, what's going on is that the Earth is not a perfect sphere. Uh, the Earth is an elliptical, you know. So what happens is as the Earth is revolving around the Sun. 
there comes a climax, you know, a very uh, high point where the earth meets the sun on a climax. And this happens twice. It happens like at the end of September and October. And, you know, because in August, it gets cold, like it's winter. But then in like late September and October, it gets warm again, like it's July and August. And then it gets cold again, I guess in November and December, then it gets cold again. So this is uh, because the Earth is uh, not a perfect sphere. The Earth is an elliptical. So because it's an elliptical, it's hitting the, it's hitting the climax point of the sun not once but twice so you have extreme temperatures of 90 and 100 degrees and and so like it's spring break all the time here man that's why I moved here so as a consolation prize they took all my money but I'm about to get my money back because now I filed a subpoena with the district attorney I'm, I'm like arresting everybody in the district attorney's office because I found out that Sharon uh, Wu, a Hong, Hong Kong lady, is like trying to take over Los Angeles. So, you know, City National Bank, which I'm taking revenge on for hiring me, City National Bank is in the uh, free for all pillaging business. They're hiring software engineers and senior software developers, and they're hiring talent from New York, consultants. They're hiring talent from New York, and they're killing like entire families of people who are relocating from New York and from. Texas and from Chicago and from all different parts of Miami all different parts of the United States City National Bank with Facebook and Priscilla Chan and Mark Zuckerberg and Joyce Lee I blame City National Bank this is how City National Bank and Bank of America and T-Tech which is Condo and Al Universal this is how City National Bank is getting so rich because they're hiring people and it makes it look like they were hiring me but this Calvin Say, I think Mariana Caval was on the cover because I think she's like really a Marine along with Andy Jablon. And, uh, and so they're hiring talent like myself from New York. They're killing us. They take, they're robbing our money. And this is how they're getting so rich. And they're trying to make Sharon Wu, who's like an owner of City National Bank, this... South China Sea, Filipino, Hong Kong lady is trying to take over Los Angeles from George Gasson and from, uh, and from, uh, Alan Stanford, aka Larry Moran, aka, um, Lawrence D. Rubin, Rubin, aka, um, uh, Laura Jane Kessner, you know, the Irish Republican Army, Pat Murray, Carol Murray, Lynn Brescia, who stole my house, Mary Primtash, so, what I'm telling you here is like, there's like a rivalry between the Irish and the Hong Kong trying to take over Los Angeles. And I'm busting the whole operation with the California Highway Patrol on a uh, motion to intervene and motion of enforcement. So I'm giving the California Highway Patrol 25% and also President Joe Biden 25% for a motion of enforcement, motion to intervene on a writ of mandate and writ of execution. Highway Patrol is coming in to bust everything and bust this organized crime ring from New York. Really, they're like the people from Empire, you know? The people from Empire are taking over Las Vegas and DWSS, now DPSS, and people from um, New York City are like trying to take over Los Angeles. That's not going to happen because they fucked the wrong guy. They took my house. They fucked the wrong guy.